Hey, what's up guys? I'm reviewing the Everlast Paracore Heavy Bag, so let's get started. This bag is 4 feet long and 80 pounds, and it's black with yellow on the top and the bottom. It has the Everlast logo across here. Down here it has Paracore, and along the side it says Greatness is Within. Great. At the bottom it has this nylon strap where you can attach weight. I personally wouldn't recommend it because I like my bag to move around. And since I have this crappy stand, the bag doesn't move anywhere. So, unless you like the bag to stand still, then I wouldn't really use that. So the bag comes with four straps right here. Then it ties to two D-rings. And a carabiner up here. It also comes with this chain in case you want the bag to be a little lower. The stitching along the bag isn't too bad. You see right here. A little crappy up here. It's not... Stitching here is okay. It has this rough nylon material. It has stuff in the bag. So the bag came with this broken zipper. You can see that right here. It came like that. And it has synthetic fiber. Just cloth like material. See? With several bags of sand inside to make the core. So I got this bag filled for about $90. And, well, it's a cheap bag, so it's going to have its problems. I've had this bag for around a year, and immediately the weight starts to settle into the bottom. And you can hear it here. It's pretty damn hard. And because I practice my kicks on this bag, the low kicks are really, really hard. And on top of the bag over here, it's Pretty, pretty soft. I have these lumps right around here where I throw my kicks. And the back doesn't hold up too well, actually. I mean, I'm a beginner and this bag really doesn't do it for me. It's not very good quality. It's okay. The thing about it is that the bag is cheap. And honestly, I could just unpack the bag and refill it, but... It defeats the whole purpose of the bag being filled already. So, I don't really like it. So, overall, I do not recommend this bag.